The best, easiest, and most cost-effective way to address accessibility is at the beginning of a project, but that's not always what happens. That doesn't necessarily mean you have to completely redo your site in order to make it accessible. If you'd like to get started with testing and improving the accessibility of your site, it can be hard to know where to start. Should you find a tool that you can plug your URL into? How reliable or comprehensive are the results? Are they just trying to sell you on their product or service? Are there other ways to test for accessibility or double check what you're already doing? The videos in this series will go over the different accessibility testing tools that you can use to start making your website more accessible. There are three main ways to test a site for accessibility. You have automated scanning, testing with assistive tools like bookmarklets and browser extensions, and then you have manual testing. When an accessibility expert reviews your site, all three of these testing methods come together with their knowledge of accessibility requirements and best practices to provide you with your path towards making your site accessible for your audience. And knowing what tools to use can be a major step forward in making sure your site is accessible. These tools aren't gonna pick up everything and nothing can replace a human reviewing your site, but catching some of the quick wins and easier fixes now are gonna help you catch some of the repeating accessibility issues and keep you from making the same mistakes over and over again. It can even help when you do get a full accessibility audit of your site. Instead of spending their time pointing out repetitive issues or things that are easier to catch, they can focus on the more complex things, the gray areas and the it depends scenarios. So check out the videos in this playlist for bookmarklets, browser extensions, site scanners, checklists, and more.